Good evening. The race for La Crosse County Sheriff came to an end Monday. Fritz Leinfelder conceded to John Siegel following a very close race. News 19's Colton Emsweiler spoke with Mr. Siegel this morning to discuss how he plans Colton to move ahead. It was a close race, Dave. Only 176 votes decided the victor after a recount, something we've kept a close eye on since election night. During the two weeks before the race became certified, Siegel says that was the most nervous stretch of the whole campaign, in which he had a handful of volunteers handle certain operations while using social media to reach out to voters. Siegel saying that his favorite part was meeting new people along the way, and on election night, he was happy when the, resu when the results came in, but adds it was reserved excitement as he anticipated the, f the further actions we've reported on, such as the aforementioned recount, to take place. But that's now in the rearview mirror as Siegel spoke with us on what to expect during his soon-to-be role as sheriff, and objective number one, establish the department's identity and philosophy. I would hope that every sheriff, when they're elected, shares their vision for um, their department, what they want to be, um, how we want to be in this community. And so that first week is when we're going to talk about what is our vision for the Sheriff's Office, what do we do well, what do we want to accomplish over the next four years, and moving forward beyond that. Siegel adds that he's close with other sheriffs across the state and has picked their brains for a little advice on how to handle certain situations. But speaking of vision, Dave, Siegel says that he plans to be very visible to the people of La Crosse County, making sure the people know that law enforcement is always around to provide a helping hand when needed. All right, Colton, thanks very much. Current Sheriff Jeff Wolf stepping down after just one term. Siegel says he plans to serve longer. His inauguration is Monday, January 2nd.